here in Supreme Commander 2, doing the final chapter, um, and the fourth Cybern mission. Thank you, hard. Alright. The gate of the Ecosynthesizer appears occupied. Indeed. There are five commanders in the area, and two appear to be former classmates of yours. A Dominic Maddox, and a Thalia Kale. And if the intel I have gathered is correct, both are wanted for treason. Dominic, Thalia, this is Ivan Brackman. Why, if it isn't my old roommate, long time no see. Sure could use your help. What do you need from me? The Guardians have been sending waves of armies at us to try to secure the gate. One of them made it through. So did Gage. I know all about Commander Gage. We can't hold them off much longer. The commander nearest your position drew the short straw and is isolated from his fellow thugs. He's a prime target. Dom and I can hold off the other commanders for now. Be careful, Ivan. If my data is accurate, the Guardian ACUs are piloted by common criminals. And we need to get to Seraphim 7 quickly. Wonderful. All right, we gotta be quick about building up some defense and econ because we're gonna be under heavy attack from this guy from the get go. Um, you have no chance of second. victory here. Just your end. So if you watched my last video for the previous mission, you know, I was kind of talking at one point about how um, the way the story kind of starts to get a little bit more ridiculous than it was before. This is a good example of the beginning of this mission. Um, and it's something interesting I want to bring up actually. Let me uh, do some structure research first here. Uh, you want to get shield generators right away. A lot of the strategies in cyber missions help if you can um, get shield generators. Which commander generators. should we target first? The ugly one. Can you be more specific? Build. New research options are available. On a line. Turrets down there. And I want a pair of shield generators. And we need to build some power generators here. Tell me I've got a free one. Yeah, there we go. Send this guy on patrol around the whole base. Let's pick up some mass in my commander. These guys need to start getting building. Looks like we need power generators more than mass. Let's build a couple in my commander here. Hopefully, we can get them down. Why quick. are both of you wanted? It's complicated. We have issues. Yeah, okay. Here again. More <laughs> shit starting to piss me off. <laughs> Alright, so what I was saying earlier, um, the thing that bugged me out was like the whole idea that these three guys are classmates and all just gonna happen to be like meeting up and working together and shit. And the thing that bugs me is that uh, it really feels very anime. Um, for what was otherwise generally not a game that was influenced by or felt influenced by it before. And I kind of blame Square Enix for this, because um, I remember reading when this game was still in development that Square Enix had been brought in for Superior Commander 2 to make the story more appealing, so it had, and give it some direction because the previous games, you know, didn't sell so well and so forth, even though they were really great and had a strong following. Um, so yeah, I, I blame Square for being really fucking cheesy. <laughs> and, I mean, think about it. Uh, how many animes do you know of, I mean, I, can, I know at least several, um, where it's all about, you know, oh yeah, we're a bunch of classmates and we're all friends, yet we've somehow acquired massive robots of massive destruction capabilities and 
now we're all fighting together or against each other or blah 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 like Jesus Christ like that like I was pretty tolerant of the whole story of this game kind of up until you know the cyber chapter and this is where it's been really bothering me um, these last four missions <laughs> all of creation will submit after we claim Shiva so sorry for the rant and I know probably there's even a few people are like, what took you this long? But, um, could be also that, I was just paying attention to it more. But, I don't know. Um, or I guess my tolerance for it <laughs> was higher earlier in this, uh, series of walkthroughs. But yeah, sorry, I know I kind of went off on a rant there. Okay, we are going to need... Do either of you have any research. idea why these Guardian commanders are no longer in prison? I might be responsible for that. Should we be aware of any other crimes you've committed? That about covers it. But remind us again how this gate became so accessible to everyone. Stop it, both of you. Again. Like, they even act like children in high school. It's really kind of... I guess there was a lot of that before, I just wasn't just culminating at this point. <laughs> Alright. I know usually I also try not to make too much of a statement outside of the actual purpose of the walkthroughs, but. Nah. Or try to remain opinion neutral. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Okay, anyways, um, so, a little overview of what's going on, um, secret objective here is really easy, we gotta build four Soul Ripper 2s, um, not entirely sure if they have to be alive at the same time, it's probably a good idea, um, that they are, it seems like most experimentals are build X amount of experimentals, uh, cause there's been one for the UEF, one for the Aeon, and one for Cybrid, they usually want them, um, uh, all alive at the same time. I know it's the way it's been so far, so I'm try to do that. Yeah, let's try to build another three research stations here. And we are severely lacking in AA, and that's a problem I'm going to be fixing right about now. Now, um, our friends here at Thalia and Maddox are going to be under constant attack during this mission. And, um, they are okay to survive, it seems, until about the 20 minute mark when they start to get overwhelmed. Uh, this doesn't seem to be an exact trigger for when you have to go start helping them. It's just that seems to be when the enemy AI seems to pick up their attacks to the point where they can't stop it anymore. Um,. So we're gonna have to send some forces over there, and partially there are because additional assault blocks on the battlefield. It is worth noting that these are powerful units. I got it. I was gonna say partially because of um, our secret objective here. I'm just gonna go for all Soul Ripper twos. Try to dump all the funds this I got. Just into like that. old times, eh, Ivan? I don't recall being fired on by ex-cons during our academy days. By the way, that's also the second time that almost exact line has come up. Just like old times, oh, I don't remember it happening this way. Like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I advance, or I apologize in advance for all the bitching you might hear about the storyline for the next couple videos. I'm just kidding, I'm not trying to make it that big of a deal. Alright. Um... Alright, now 
we got assault blocks attacking. Probably gonna want to start doubling up on our shields here. Not that we were already on, but even more so. Right, we lost an engineer. You should consider researching the new technologies I've made available to you. Let's build a land factory so I can get some engineers out as I need them. Let's build some energy generators. Just so that I make sure I have plenty. My AA stands to be a little bit closer than it currently is. towers right there. Alright, we've got Soul Ripper 2 now. The Soul Ripper can be constructed at an experimental air factory. This will give us air superiority. Alright, let's get that air gantry up. good thing about using Soul Ripper 2s is that they have a little bit of air defense themselves and the enemy doesn't use strong air in this mission in terms of strong anti-air air. Um, they have anti-air assault bots but enough Soul Ripper 2s can actually take that down really quick without much difficulty at all. Let's upgrade the fire rate turrets. Now, you want to start rushing these soul rippers, because you want to take out this commander really soon. It needs to be before that 20 minute mark, and then get soul ripper 2s here, so that these guys are defended around that same time. Start building insane amounts of energy generators here. I know that's a lot, but they're going to unlock mass conversion soon. It'll actually take a while to build that many with just one engineer. So let's add another row of this guy. I might stop that eventually, but for now. Let's actually do this. Let's build another experimental gantry. About two Soul Ripper 2s at a time. We're sustaining heavy damage. We need your help, ASAP. They're fine. Some energy in a mass. 
There we go. Got that second Soul Ripper started. Sources into ACU. I'm a tactical missile to harass the enemy with for now. Attack. We need to jack up this base quick and get its commander. Freedom never tasted sweeter. Alright, let's try to get these Soul Ripper 2s out of there. Damn. Commander Burkett is falling. Oh, I lost Soul 3. That's not good. Usually you want to try to save at least one of those. Fuck. You can do it if you pull them away in time, but I didn't, so. After we're done with you, your family will follow. We need to hurry up and get these guys into the base there. So they're going to be overwhelmed really quick. So I'm defending them now. Still managed to get a dude there in time. It'd be better if I still had those other soul rippers left. But at least we killed this commander early enough that uh you know I still had time to build more. Those two should be able to do fine. Now these soul rivers that are coming off the line now are going to be used for my purposes. So yeah, and I don't think that secret achievement's popped yet, so it's definitely four alive at the same time. Alright, uh, we'll see in a second once the next one comes out. For sure. Alright, 
Let's preemptive strike these guys coming out of the teleporter here. Take out that assault block first. Those teleports actually work as uh, two-way devices, and you'll see that the enemy starts, or our ally starts sending their units through it. There you go, see? Although they're not going to actually do much with those weak attacks. Yeah, there's a secret objective unlocked. Looks like there's not many guys defending this base. That was a good time to attack it. Send those two soul rippers up to protect from the incoming forces. Let's take out these air defenses. Two soul rippers up. Gonna run a pincher and move. Pincer. commanders and what protect them all right we're this doesn't really want me to I guess dude doesn't really care that much how much or what I research so um yeah we can actually start getting pretty close to ending this mission you cannot hide there's no escaping us taking out all these factories and the engineers so that when I take out the commander the space actually starts to get shut down as opposed to just taking a lot of damage and continuing without him. Take what's rightly ours. Right, let's send these guys out of here.
Yes, Commander Larson is down. Ivan, this uncharacteristic display of emotion is most curious. So many soul rippers, this is gonna be ridiculous. But it's gonna be fun. Right, let's pull them over this group that teleported in. this mission you can uh, use those teleporters to send your shit in and take out the enemy that way that's really good and useful but this is so much better <laughs> at least in my opinion it'll take There's more one than of those anti air bots and the UE have to stop us when we get all the sheep on to defend it from any other guardians. I have a score to settle with Gage. You must stay here with Dominic. I can assure you that I will show him no mercy. As for both of your legal issues, my father has been in contact with the UEF and Illumina governments. Ooh, see, that's not so good. I have a family I'd like to see again, sometime this decade. The UEF is aware that Rogers overstepped his authority, so you're looking at an honorable discharge. Thalia's situation is more complicated. I've accepted my fate. I just want to see my brother one more time. Very well, my friends. I wish you continued luck. I'm ready to return to Seraphim 7. I am quite interested to see what Commander Gage has done at the place. Operation completed. Alright. That's a wrap for this one.